What's up, guys? It's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Black Walkthrough. Okay, so we finally got to Mr. Elton City, and, uh, well, it is the next adventure right here. We got a next badge coming forward, and, uh, well, people to meet, Pokemon to capture, Legends to Untold, you know, that kind of stuff. So let's go right here in this house. Now, if you go into this house right here, you got two different kinds of people, the Pokemon Rememberer and the Pokemon uh, Move Deleter right here. Now, if you give her a, mo a uh, hard scale, she'll actually teach one of your Pokemon a move that it actually remembered back then when it was growing up. This guy right here will actually delete any kind of moves that your Pokemon knows, like AJ moves and all that crud. So remember that. Remember, it's right here in Mr. Elton City. Now, if we go a little forward right here, the repel will wear out. And if we go a little upward right here, we got two people walking by. And homie here is looking at you all cockeyed and everything. He's like, oh, hey, Draven, right? Let me, uh, let me see your Pokedex for a moment. What do we have here? So, you found 68 Pokemon, eh? Staggering. You've seen it, Clink. You're becoming quite the trainer. Excuse me, I was a little excited to, and I forgot my manners. My name is Juniper too. Cedric Juniper, that is. Hey, the professor who gave you the Pokedex is my daughter. Aww. The girl who, or the girl has told me a lot about you. It really makes my day to meet you. In honor of our meeting, I'm going to upgrade your Pokedex. Look at that, throwing out the peace sign because he upgraded my Pokedex and whatnot. Some Pokemon can change forms even when it's in the same, uh, the same individual. If you have already seen a form, you can check it right here whenever you want. I also added a function to make searching easier. And well, hello, hello there. How are you doing there? Professor, who is that trainer? Oh, I forgot to I forgot my introduction. Skyla, this is a friend of my daughter's. Draven is driving, traveling around, you know, but to compete or to complete the Pokédex. Oh, I see. So that means you'll be challenging the gym. Oh boy, I'm really I'm really looking forward to it. I'm looking forward to it too. That's right. That's right, Draven. You should challenge this gym. If not nothing else, this gym is really out there. See, Skyla, if something comes up again, I will let you know. Professor, my plane is a cargo plane. It carries cargo, not people. And you're talking uh, you're talking as if the places like Kanto and Sinnoh are right around the corner. Aw, oh, Skyla, if you keep frowning, your face might freeze like that, and that'd be a shame. Yes, yeah, Skyla, quit frowning. You're ruining your beauty. People and Pokemon, we all have to help each other out. See you later. Alright, okay. I'll see you, homeboy. I will see you. Sheesh. It's hard to believe that a happy-go-lucky guy like that could be world-renowned Pokemon professor. Heads up, Draven. As a gym leader, I'd be happy to give you a challenge, or have you challenge the gym, but there's something I need to take care of first. Just now, uh, as I was flying the cargo plane, I saw something on top of the Celestial Tower. I'm sure that it's a, it's a sick Pokemon. If it is, I can't just leave it there. I have to go look at, at this right away. I'm leaving for Route 7 Celestial so Tower. You can come along if you want. Okay, I will, I will indeed uh, see you there. Mm, 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 mm. Anywho. Alright, so let's go ahead and take a small tour of uh, Mr. Alton City. Uh, there's quite a few things you can actually find here. Yeah, uh, like strewn in the windblown leaves. Now let's go right here. Let's go ahead and uh, see what, what, what this is all about. Now, if you talk to this kid, if you have a gym badge from Mr. Alton, I'll tell you something cool. Okay, well, remember this guy, okay? After you defeat the gym leader. Cannons, cannons! Skyland's gym is full of cannons. That is true. And there are a lot of greenhouses around the runway. Freshly picked vegetables can be sent to faraway regions very quickly. True, true, true. That is all we need. And, uh, well, let's go right ahead and, uh, let's see, what is this place right here? Mr. Elton Cargo Service, our slogan is quick and safe. Well, let's see what let's see what this guy has to say. The only planes that fly out of the Stralton Airport are cargo planes. If trainers want to fly, they can go with the Pokemon that knows how to fly. How to, how to fly. Uh, let's see if it goes up right here. Let's see if we can actually find something pretty interesting. All right, let's see. Uh, let's see. When you use the move fly, you can uh, return to Pokemon Center you've already visited. But if a Pokemon doesn't know their destination, they cannot fly there. That is true. Let's see. I've been in here. Hello. Deliver a lot of cargo quickly. This is Mr. Allison Cargo Service. Ah, she doesn't do anything. I'm trying to look for somebody here who gives me an item. 
For places that I cannot reach, I ask, I ask flying or psychic type Pokemon for help sometimes. How can I imagine everyday life without Pokemon? It's kind of like cell phones, technology, and all that stuff. How the world has changed and all that stuff. Now, let's see. Welcome to the Sky City, Mr. Alton. Take this as a keepsake. And look at that. We get ourselves the Sharpie, which will increase the attack of any kind of flying type Pokemon. That's good. Very, very good. And uh, sweets and lovely sweetheart. Check feelings between two people. If you're a great match, you can uh, get sweet on the sweetheart. Mentally, wait, 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 meltingly sweet sweetheart. The hell? If you bring a lot of sweetheart pro uh, pieces, I will trade you for something happy. Okay, that's cool, that's cool, that's very good. Because I know a lot of planes, I can maintain them. Because I know a lot of Pokemon, I can be strong. Alright, and uh, move along right here. My dream, my dream was to become a pilot and fly away, far away. I still have to, I still have my dream in my heart. So he is not a pilot or anything. Okay, so that right there was nothing. Let's go right ahead and uh, check out a few things right here. Now, I think you can find a few items. Let's see, like this guy, it's dangerous to play on the landing strip, but it, you should be okay in ours. We only have a, one cargo uh, flight a day. True, that is true. But right here, if you go into this area, you will actually find yourself a few items. Like this one right here, TM58 Skydrop. Very, very good move. Very good flying type move, so I might teach that to Sigalift right there. And, uh, well, let's see, mechanics of flying and all that stuff. People who are obsessed with flying right here are pretty uh, crazy and stuff. If you ask me how many times I've ever been on a plane, I've been on a plane like four times. That's about it. Vegetables grown in a greenhouse are best, are the best. The temperatures and the nutrients are all managed systematically. Vegetables grown in a completely deficient way taste extra delicious. Actually, four times? It can't be four times. It'd probably be... Probably like an upwards of like eight, maybe eight times right there. I don't know. All right, so let's go use the dowsing machine. And uh, yeah, normally you would actually find some items right here. So let's uh, let's see, right here now, right here. There you go. Yeah, you'll de you'll definitely find some hidden items around this area. So let's go right here, right here. Look at that, Ma Max Ether. You gotta love that one right there. And uh, let's see, where are the? Okay, right. Where are you? Where are you, little bastard? I usually have trouble with this thing right here. Let's see. Right. Okay, right here. Nope. It's uh, upwards right here. There we go. Okay, so we found a paralysis heal. Nice. And uh, I think that's pretty much it right there. So where you guys can actually locate the gym is actually up upwards right here. And uh, let's see. If you talk to this lady, Pokemon and people work together to open a desolate land and make a place where everyone could live. I'm certain that this cooperative spirit will uh, remain unchanged. Maybe if, uh, unless you got like some dickhead, like dickhead uh, criminal group or anything like that. And uh, let's see, there's no items right here. But this is the Mr. Uh, the Mr. Alton gym right here. And uh, let's see, I'm trying to look for another item. No items, no hidden items right there. So let's go right ahead and uh, talk to the homeboy that's only believed in us. The only one that's ever believed in us. He's like, Skylet, uh, Skylet completed her cargo her cargo plane run. She must uh, have gone somewhere after. Maybe to the Celestial Tower at Route 7. Man, well, everybody's talking about that one, so... That's pretty much what we're going to do right now. Or in the next episode, I guess. Yes, we're taking a small tour. It is what it is, guys. Lexi, talk to this guy right here. And I hear many people have uh, had their Pokemon stolen by Team Plasma. That is true. Very, very true. Okay, so in the next episode, guys, we're going to be going to Route 7. We're going to be taking care of a few things right there. And then, uh, well, it's a lot of Steel Tower and all that stuff. And then Gym Battle. So, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time.